Hi guys, I'm Gary the Ferret, and today we are in Spin Tires. Now, we're playing this today because I just wanted to talk about a few things. First off, I'd like to point out the obvious. Yes, I am wearing a hat. Yes, it is a Gigabyte hat. If yeah, it is this side. Yeah, see? Yeah? 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 I'm not sponsored by them, they just happen to send me one. Along with this. And these. If you notice, this one looks like a motherboard. It's got ultra durable on the back. But freebies aside. I thought I'd give a bit of an update on things. Yes, I am using a controller for this. Anyway, I suppose the first thing to cover is uh, my current situation. Uh, hopefully, I should have a job soon which means I'll have more money to do things such as uh, component reviews and games it should also mean if I do get the job I'll be able to attend Insomnia, Insomnia 56 in December it's one of the largest gaming con gaming uh, festivals in the UK the only problem with this job that I might have is that it's night work it's 12 uh, midnight until 8 a.m. but hopefully I should have time during the day to make videos as long as I'm not tired so hopefully I might end up doing daily videos we'll see if not then it'll be three times a week and I promise that one that it'll be at least three times a week three times a week as soon as I'm able to because looking for work takes up a lot takes up a lot of time I'd also like to thank the people who already subscribed it means a lot that you're watching still and I hope you stay subscribed and to those who are new to my channel welcome I hope you have fun watching so if I do get this job it'll mean I'll be able to upgrade my rig as well and camera equipment and other stuff which is good <sighs> bugger um let's select low no I don't want reverse no I don't want auto give me low thank you see stuck on a tree bugger but yeah hopefully I'll be able to upgrade my rig from what I'm currently using which is 
a rather old Phenom 2 965 Black Edition and a three year old GTX 660 OC Wind Force Edition so yeah come on you bastard get through there plow through thank you now what this means for you guys is you'll be seeing much better quality videos because I will be aiming to at least get one 980 Ti in my rig and a much better processor I'm either going to get an 80, FX8350 or I will hold out for a bit until the new Zen cores are coming out at which point I'll then also do a review on the Zen core yeah, that'll be a good one a rig build and a review of a new processor in one now that would be pretty fun wouldn't you agree guys eh? let me know in the comments but yeah if I do go to Insomnia 56 I will most likely be attending with the Bread Wizard Yes, I know I've already gone to events with him once, but what can I say, we both live in the same city, not even two miles apart from each other, so it kind of makes sense. Hopefully I will be doing future videos with him as well, in game, most likely on um, things like grid auto sport and with the uh, drifting online which will be pretty fun because he uses a racing wheel and at the moment I use a 360 controller but I'm also hoping to get a racing wheel either a G27 or the new G29 I'm not sure I mean the G27's proven but the G29 that just looks so badass and yeah it's just the sort of wheel that I'd want Come on, come on, come on, that's it, that's it, that's it. You don't want to dig. No, don't dig. Don't sit there either. That's it, you're slowly moving. Yes, that's it. Come on. Yes, I'll also be hoping to do more vlog style videos as well. And when I go to events, I will provide you guys with coverage. The events I'll normally go to will probably be um, like Eurogamer and um, Insomnia. But, they're still pretty big events. so it's all good um, anyway that's, I think that's all the updates I've got to tell you so uh, yeah if there's anything that you would like to see that I can actually 
do at the moment then please let me know in the comments below in the meantime uh, let's see if I can go and pick up the lumber without crashing hmm? uh, shift it into auto come on you bastard I know, I know there's YouTubers who use some um, mods, but to be honest, I can't really be bothered with mods because it seems like too much hard work swapping around, swapping them around so that they work with the updates. I mean, that's if you have to change them when the updates are done. Like you do with um, Euro Truck Sim 2. Which is rather annoying when you've got to do that. Or when you've got to completely remove a mod, you end up having to do a load of stuff all over again because it broke the save. Very annoying when it does that. Mm, come on. Come on. Come on. Yes, that's it. Push it to the side. There we go. Come on, come on, pull it through, pull through. There we go. Hmm. But, yeah, as I was saying, I know some YouTubers such as Tomcat use mods, but I just can't be bothered. I mean, I've got a mod but that's just to um, make the little 4x4 a little better I don't think it's had an update since I've put that on um, I'll have to check actually I might, I might be completely wrong and what have you, but yeah. Oh, I'll, I'll have a look, and then I'll decide after that whether I'll try out some more mods, because. To be honest, the mods do look really fun when they're well executed. Such as the spawn in, Spawned in Darkness mods that Tomcat likes. They look really good. And they're well done. Hmm. 
And if any of you don't know who Tomcat is, I'll leave a link to his channel in this in the the in the description. So you can go check him out. It's not just things like spin tires that he does either. He does a lot of Xbox One games such as Forza Motorsport 6 and Forza Horizon 2. So, yeah. If you like console games, he's your man. And so is EK Drifter 458. He plays a lot of Forza Motorsport. Uh, I know both of them play GTA 5 at times. I also play it. I've completed the story art, a uh, story mode, mostly. There's a few side missions to do still, but the main story I've done. So, yeah. Oh, come on, you bastard. Get through. Oh, sorry about that, guys. I'm going to have to leave it there. So, as always, if you liked the video, then please leave a like, comment, and subscribe. If you didn't like the video, then leave a like, dislike, and maybe tell me why you didn't like it. But anyway, guys, catch you in the next one.